Welcome back to Sister Sakala. <laughs> her next guest just happens to be one of our favorite Braxton sisters, aside from, of course, our beloved Trina, of course. She's here with her new music and the inside scoop to this juicy new season, honey, of Braxton family family values. The juicy. Let's take a look. It's juicy. I, the people say, do you want to do this? I enjoy doing this. What do you enjoy about it? I enjoy teaching others how family are. And we may not be the best family, and we may argue and fuss, but we love hard. But is it, maybe it's time for you all to redefine how you love. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that was a little deep right there. Y'all went deep. Okay, please welcome down to the circle my beautiful big sister, Tracy Renee Braxton. Hello. I woke up. No, I didn't Come wake on, up like this. I really didn't. <laughs> Come on. Wow. Tracy, I hear your little song, girl, at Shaw. I love it. Yes, you know, thank you. Thank you. That's my favorite on the album, by the it way. Is. Yes, I like it. Oh, you wow. Okay, so Tracy, you have been with us before. Uh -huh. Thank you. But now you're back in the studio. Yes. Okay, so Tracy, you have been with us before. But now you are back down to the circle and you're being interviewed by your sister. I know. Oh, Isn't that oh, 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 How does it feel? Yes. And did you give her any advice on how to, you know, how to perform on her new gig? As her big sister. As big sister, I'm so proud of all my sisters, but mm -hmm. I'm so proud of Trina. She, uh, she's grown leaps and bounds, and all right. she just matured into her own person, and I'm so proud of her. Aww. But no, I didn't give her any advice because she already has it. Oh, Ray! Oh, y'all gonna cry. I'm not gonna cry. I'm yeah. not gonna cry. I'm not gonna mess up my makeup at 9 o'clock. No, but right. this is what we done when yes. we was younger, when we was growing up. We would videotape each other. Like, we have our own talk shows mm -hmm. and things like mm -hmm. that. Yeah. And our cooking shows. So, That's what she told you me. Know, she we, said, yeah. y'all used to do the Definitely talk show down yeah. to the family. But, Tracy, let's talk about you for a minute. This is your moment. And But, but before we get all the way into <laughs> everything, Tracy Braxton, let's talk about the breakfast yeah. for just two seconds. Okay. So... We come from a huge family. There's uh -huh. a kindergarten class full of us. Whole trough. But, and everybody seems to play a role in mm -hmm. our family. What do you think your role is? Ooh, I think my role has always been the protector. Of? Of all my sisters. Yes. So that was my, <laughs> <laughs> that was my role in the family. I had to make sure they was okay. I was always that, my parents always said, who's in charge of the girls? Yeah. And I always had to say, I'm in charge of the girls. Of the girls. <laughs> <laughs> and so, you know, that, I love that. I love being that protector of my sisters. Well, you've always so been a protector, times. period. And now you're a new duchess. And we have my first great nephew. Oh, yes. You are the oh, first yeah. sibling in our family to have yeah. a grandbaby. <laughs> Look at that little baby. Yeah, that's, that's how you got to talk. That's how you So how are you feeling about being a duchess? Didn't you just see how I, I just act? <laughs> 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 He's so cute. <laughs> cheek, cheek oh, my God. Oh, he is so loving. But, you know, people say kids don't really have a, um, a, a, a personality. Mm -hmm. This little boy has a personality. He's all the way Taurus. He's me. <laughs> well, I have to tell you, I have been watching the Braxton Family Values, okay, and I okay. just love it. Okay, thank, thank you. you. I tell you, but there are some episodes in there that it is just you alone with your friends, uh -huh. and that is new for you guys this, this season. Mm -hmm. Filming with other people, being used to filming with your sisters at the time, because I have sisters and we're super mm -hmm. close. Do you miss your sisters? Or did you miss your sisters when you were filming with others? Oh my God, I did. I cried every day when oh, my no. sisters weren't with me, you know? Even though I have friends and showing my life and things, but it wasn't, it, it wasn't fulfilled because it, it, it felt like something was missing, you know? But I had a job to do and I did it. I know, that's right. But you know, Tracy, the thing is, we, we've already heard all the stories about Braxton Family Values, but let's focus on Tracy Braxton for just a that. moment. Okay. Let's talk about your new music, and let's talk about On Earth, your sophomore yes, album. I'm yes. so super proud of you. So tell me about your inspiration with this album, your sophomore <laughs> album. My sophomore album, it took me a while to get it out, mm -hmm. but it, it, it brought along a lot of emotions. I sat down and collaborated with a lot of the writers that's mm -hmm. there, and, a, and a producers, and I gave my all. And, 
even though I had some I hate you Jody moments, <laughs> there was also <laughs> there was also moments that, that I missed about my sisters and mm -hmm. things like that. Like lifeline, lifeline is I would die for you. Oh, I would live my whole life just for you. So that's what lifeline is about. So that's the first single that's out. Well, yeah, when we come great. back, we're going to talk more about your album and everything Tracy Definitely. Braxton. Yes. <laughs> so stay with us. Don't go anywhere. This is my order. I know that's right. And I'm very right. proud. Mm -hmm. you I know, know that's right. And I'm right. excited about my sophomore album. I thought it would never happen. At first, I was going to quit and not mm -hmm. sing anymore. Mm -hmm. But, you know, I, I, I just felt that I have more song to sing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm so full of song, and I get it when artists say, you know, or singers say, I have so much to give yes, and so much. Yes, pregnant yes. yes. Yeah. and it's, I, I have to get it out. And while it's bottled in, it, it's harming me because mm -hmm. I'm like, oh my God, I gotta do it. And then you exactly. end up singing every goddamn thing that you hear. Oh, yeah. Seven on national television. Oh, I'm sorry. We're gonna skip to the game. All right, uh, we have a game called Sister Circle. I mean, Sister Sister. Because we want to get all in y'all business. Trina, go sit on Can me. I keep my job for more than a month, Trina? Yeah. I'm just saying. Y'all just acting up down we to the table. <laughs> you have this paddle, that's your I'm face. I'm sorry, yeah, everybody know my mouth. I am so sorry, y'all. Oh, I got to pay a fine that's now. That's fine, girl. Stop <laughs> getting my coins okay, away. So listen, okay, listen. I'm going to give y'all uh, see who. I'm going to give y'all a line, a directive. And then you all tell me which sister is the one who does it. Mm. Okay, between the two of you, who's the funniest? Okay, y'all disagree. Yes. All right. Who's most you likely? You think you funny? Next question. Who's most likely to miss their flight? Ooh. You are just I don't really, miss flights. I'm just, always on time. You just really I'm don't know each other. you gonna make me on time. What would you like this? Okay. Who's most likely to drink before noon? Okay. All righty then. And uh, <laughs> you just know you know. <laughs> Last but not least, treat, really. who is mom's favorite? Uh oh. Oh, you agreed on that one, Miss E. Well, we thank you so much for being with us today. Make sure you check out her new album on Earth Out Now.